today I'm gonna bring a Hamilton Beach breakfast sandwich making machine. We're gonna put it to use today and see if it even works because um, it's number one seller in Amazon. We're gonna take a look at it. Um, I'm a little curious about it, so let's go ahead and put it to use today. I haven't opened it, first time opening it. And uh, you guys can see, you can make all sorts of sandwiches along with the egg included. So um, I want to see if it actually works. So let's go ahead and put it to use. When you guys get the machine, just make sure you clean it. And if you want, you can even wash it because it's dusty. Get a damp towel and make sure everything section is clean. Now, it, it's a little hard to understand the instructions, but we're going to show you how to use it. Uh, I'm going to try to show you how to use it because I'm... Um, First time using it too myself so we're gonna go ahead and do that but just make sure everything's clean all right and a little dust here and there but um, out of the box you got these sections you got one section here you got this section and this section is where the egg goes I guess you drop the egg in there you could scramble the egg and then the bottom section is where the bread goes so um, you could drop the bread after the egg so this is supposed to heat up the egg and the bread on the top of the egg, and you put it together. Um, pretty much, you drop the egg in here. Let's clean that up a little bit more. Um, you drop the egg from here, so this section is gonna be where the egg goes. But just to let you guys know, the plug is about less than two and a half feet, really short. You're gonna need an extension cord for that if you don't have a plug around your area. So make sure that you address that too. You have a surface to plug it in, right? All right, just cranked it up with an uh, extension cord, of course, and um, we're going to see to it preheats right now. There is no buttons or anything to turn it on. It just automatically will detail itself until it preheats. So we're going to wait till it starts preheat. All right, we just got the preheat, so we're going to drop in the egg right now. So let's go ahead and do that. Make sure it's all the way back. Crack the egg. Close it up. Um, we're gonna do scramble here. So do a scramble. You can use a toothpick for this. Make sure it's closed completely. All right, close it up. We're gonna open it up to see how the egg looks like. And it's coming along, if you guys can see the egg. It's, it's looking beautiful actually um, so very impressed with the, the egg um, bread wise I'm gonna keep the bread separate from here it's making a mess so I'm just gonna cook the bacon the Canadian bacon the egg and the cheese with it which um, a good combination on it so um, the first time I used it all the egg fell because this was a little loose uh, but overall it's looking pretty good I'll just separate the bread to be honest with you um, or you could use the bread as your call but the bottom one heats up more than everything else, so um, I put the bacon there just to heat it up. We're gonna drop the cheese in there. We're gonna drop the tantara. We're gonna go ahead and drop the cheese right now. Cut a little corners because I um, don't want it to stick too much on it. You can't, but I'm just gonna drop the whole thing. There we go. Drop it in there, melt it a little bit more. All right, we're gonna go ahead and drop the egg to the bacon. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna open it up here. You guys can see. I'm gonna move a little closer so the camera can see it right there. So we're gonna go ahead and drop it. We lift this up and we just squeak, squeak, squeak the whole, move the whole thing out. You guys can notice like that, just like that. Drop the whole thing, put it back. So the egg fell to the bottom with the cheese. It's grilling. We're gonna lift it up the whole thing now. We could lift the whole thing up. And you guys can see a perfect shape. We, we could just scoop that in there. Let me scoop that in there so you guys can see it. The bacon, the egg. Um, let me get that going. The egg, bacon, egg, and everything else. Get your plate ready. Transfer it. Nice and neat. Transportation. This is perfect. Look at that. Perfect shape. I like that. The egg's perfect on that. The egg came out really nice and beautiful. Um, just put your own bread. I would say separate the bread because the steam is not very good with the bread. So, All right, one important thing. Cleaning this is not very difficult. Everything comes off of it. Um, a damp towel would do it, but I would just sanitize it. Just make sure that it's clean. 
um, very easy to remove the plates and clean them up so that's another option you can do so 